how to do this. I need obviously the valve, which is up here. That's here is where I'm going to take it from. Put my gloves on. So this syringe because I need one with a needle. Going to attach the needle like that. That's covered. And then afterwards there's a little blue thing in here which I'm going to cap off that with so I can take the needle off and then cap it on. And that way I can cap it off and then it's still sterile. I'll give this a wipe. going to use the needle in here, in this valve, like that. And then most people have a free drain catheter, or a lot of people have a free draining catheter. Mine is not free draining, so to drain I have to turn my valve, because I've got a very sensitive bladder, even though it doesn't work, it hurts. So I turn the valve and I turn it probably every 10 minutes because I can only tolerate about 10 to 15 mils of urine in my bladder before it actually really hurts me. And on my urodynamics, although the bladder was a flat line, it was reacting only to pain. But the signals that should go from bladder to brain were not working at all. That was a complete flat line. Right, so the valve, what I do is I turn the valve which lets urine drain and then I need to pull on the syringe to get urine out then I'm going to turn the valve off and then as I pull this out because I don't want any mess I pull that out Oh, that was tidy. Then remove that needle. And then I'm going to cap this off. Like that. And then I can put that in the bottle that goes to the doctors. 